In our first news today, Uber India deploys 100 e-rickshaws in Delhi. These e-rickshaws have been deployed across 26 Delhi metro stations and some of the locations are Delhi Metro's Blue Line, Ashok Park Main, Dabri Mor, ESI Basaidarpur, Janakpuri East and Uttam Nagar East. So, People in Delhi can hire an e-rickshaw from Uber app. These e-rickshaws will definitely reduce CO2 emissions in New Delhi. In our second news today, Balan Engineering Private Limited to set up an electric vehicle manufacturing unit in Bagalkot district in Karnataka. The unit will be set up in Achanur village in Bagalkot. The company to manufacture electric three-wheelers for transportation of garbage and later they will manufacture three-wheeler cargo vehicles, passenger automobiles and e-bikes. The company will set up its manufacturing plant in 2021 and provide employment opportunities as well. In our third news today, Aether Energy has raised $35 million in its latest Series D funding. The startup to use these funds to speed up its scooter deliveries and for expansion plans. Aether Energy also started setting up free charging stations in Hyderabad. The company to install free charging stations at Sarat City Capital Mall, Almond House, Taj Mahal Hotel, Swiss Castle, Flipside, Noma Takis and the Moonshine Project. These charging stations can be utilized by two-wheelers, three-wheelers and four-wheeler owners for free till the end of 2020. In our fourth news today, three-wheeler manufacturer Omega CK Mobility Private Limited started dealerships for its product Rage Plus in Kukatpalli Y Junction, Hyderabad. The Rage Plus is a cargo three-wheeler, has a load capacity of 550 kilograms and can run with a top speed of 60 kph, works with a 6 kilowatt motor. On a full charge, it can give 100 kilometers of range. In our fifth news today, Mumbai-based Alpha Vector launches its first electric cycle, Miraki, in the market. The e-bicycle works with a 250 watt IP65 protected BLDC motor and can run with a top speed of 25 kph. The 6.36 amp hour lithium-ion battery can provide 35 km of range. The company offers one year warranty on the battery pack. In our sixth news today, Andhra Pradesh government decided to set up 400 charging stations across the state. These charging stations will be set up at the national highways. One charging station will be set up for every 25 kilometers of radius. In our seventh news today, the Kerala State Road Transport Corporation (KSRTC) has invited bids for hiring 50 electric buses on wet lease for the Tiruvananthapuram zone. KSRTC to procure these electric buses under the Fame to Scheme. Go green, go electric. Electric vehicles taught in motto is keeping the earth a safer place to live for the next generations. If you want to join our movement, you can support simply subscribing to our channel or sharing our videos or commenting on videos. Thanks for watching.